Hello everybody, this is Rob from the Baz Films. Come back with more Walking Dead. Hmm, they're walking. Quite odd, quite odd indeed. There's Clementine. She appears to be drawing. I. You're back. Ben found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Cool story, bro. Tell me again. That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. You actually didn't even knock at the door. You knocked on the wall. Who knocks on a wall? Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape the women. <laughs> Kenny, and that's not nice. What did you get? We got a lot. I mean, I'm not going to be modest. We got a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. We're fine, by the way. Nice work. Lily giving you a compliment? In what universe? Down like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze very our true, Kenny. Very here. true. He's piling into an RV with you two. After what you did to my dad is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know, I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. Take a look at the wall, Lily. That's not graffiti. Those are bullet holes. And we got enough arrows. Yeah, I'm gonna defend Kenny, as it always. We have to go eventually, Lily. We don't have to do anything. You didn't want to go because of your dad's health, but he's gone now. Easy, Kenny. At it again, are we? Can it, Carly? Don't can Carly. I like Carly. People around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. I don't think you're capable anymore. It could be so much worse. When's the last time someone got bitten? Are you counting? Shut up, jobs? Ben. Jesus, Ben. We're all going a little nuts. But we can't tear each other apart. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's gotta be thinking about this shit. And you are, Kenny, so it's fine. Not been working. We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. That's BS, Kenny. And you know. We deal with shit as it comes, just like we always do. And when 15 bandits hop over that wall in the middle of the night? What then? You just go and Yeah, actually you do, that? right in this Everything game, actually. What happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. Do you know how we got these supplies? We got lucky and let a girl get eaten out there. What? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She gave us enough time to get everything we could out of the drugstore. You just let her suffer like what? Like bait? Well, we did. This is a doggy dog world, as I said in the last episode. We can't remember this. Me. It was just something that had to happen. Lee's right. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. You should be thanking Lee for not shooting that girl. It's not so easy for him. Look. Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth. And it's coming. This way. It's not going to be easy Why'd you just start screaming randomly, Lily? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right. Stealing. And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller. Well, there's only like six people here, so you know, eventually you're gonna Everybody run out of people to trust. Out. Pretty quickly, actually. She'll get over it. She's riling everybody up, otherwise. You <laughs> understand. Now, if anyone's watching this, do you like Lily? I mean, I don't know. I haven't really found a big supporter of her. Kenny's relationship is a much like bigger deal than me. are coming to a head. You could say that. Well, I think you did good today. And I find myself thinking that most days. Thanks. It's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. With her wound up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. Of course I will, Carly, because you are smoking. That's the thing about Carly. Like, in the zombie apocalypse, she still looks good. Lily, like, has gone, like, turned a million years old, and she's probably about the same age as Carly. 
And by the way, get ready for the most sexual tension-filled scene ever, even though nothing happens at all. She and she says a little bit of something at the end, but. Talk to Lily yet? No, not yet. I will. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot about you. I think about you too, Carly. I think about you too. Our group is small. You're small. You're a convicted killer. Carly, Jesus. And I think. Oh boy, you. not this again. Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. People need to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell everyone, but think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. She's right. She's right. I'll go talk to people. That'll be this episode. People might be pissed, and telling them might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what'll happen if they don't hear it from you. Yeah. So you'll do it then? I'll let people know. You're totally right. Good. I think it's for the best. Don't God. See, how much sexual tension was in that scene? A lot. And then in like the like the the no, s like kiss on the about? neck or whatever you just did. I don't know what's going on here. Thoughts about Lily? worry about her that's about it she keeps trying to run things but it's just not working hmm which one should I ask her do you feel safe here show me a bath with a heated floor and a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. oh that doesn't really have enough in the real world anyway it's not even little of the zombie apocalypse any second you really think people are ready to hear about me? It's not a matter of ready or not. There's never going to be a good time, but there are going to be a lot of bad ones. Right now doesn't seem like one of them. But everyone's different. Who knows how each person would take it, you know? Maybe it's worth thinking about who you want to tell. I'm going to look into this thing. Good idea. Hmm, okay. So let's tell Clementine first. Because, I mean, she really does deserve to know. Hey, Lee. Clem, I need to talk to you for a second. Okie dokie. Yeah, I'm not going to talk about killing to her. I'm only going to say I killed someone to Kenny. But the rest of them I'm just going to mention I went to prison. And I was on my way to jail for committing a crime. I need to tell you now, because I don't want you to hear it any other way. Okay. Do you have anything to say? I don't think so. You can uh, go on back to your things. Okay, Kenny's next. I probably should have done Kenny first, because Kenny's like, I really trust him. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all carry guns now, and I don't like it. It's the way it's got to be. I know, but I'm not getting used to it. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? Yeah, I'm not getting involved in guns thing. There's a lot of side arguments you can have, like optional arguments you do with people. Yeah, I don't participate in those. They won't remember anyways. That's why I don't. It's serious. What'd the she-devil do to you? Shut up, man. I killed someone. Different than Larry or the St. John's. Different from everything. This was before the walkers. Uh... I know. I, I didn't say anything when I met you because I was with the girl and... You know, I, I was worried. I just smashed a guy's head in with a 50-pound block of salt. You saw me do that, right? Yes, I did. And you're talking about who we were? The fuck does that This way, this is exactly Everybody why I love Kenny. This got us doing now, Lee. Shit. Look, is Duck safe? Of course he is. Of course. Then shut it. 
You don't owe anybody any kind of explanation. Thank you, Kenny. I love Kenny. Kenny be like my best friend if this were actually real, because Kenny is plain awesome. And that mustache. Hi, guys. Oh, God, that mustache. Can I talk to you about something? Be my dream to have that mustache. It's I'm going to tell Katja. I don't know if she'll take it, though. I'm, I'm going to tell everyone except Duck. I don't even know if you can tell Duck, but, I mean, I'm not going to tell Duck. I was, uh, on my way to prison three months ago. You've always looked at me with kind eyes. I wonder if you could still do that if you uh, knew I was a convicted felon. My goodness, for what? How much trouble can a teacher get into? Well, plenty. But it had nothing to do with that. It was for murder. Why? He and my wife... Uh, That's were... enough. Tell me what happened when you were locked in the fridge. Should I tell her? I don't know. I'll, I'll tell her. I held Mummy back, and Kenny made sure Larry didn't get up. What did he do? He smashed his head in. He smashed his head in. <gasps> gotcha. Gotcha. Everything keeps changing. What do you expect? It's the apocalypse. Everything's going to change. Now, this is the one where, like, Carly will question when you tell her who you told. I'm going to tell Ben. Because I like Ben. I'm going to give him hey, my... Ben. I'm going to show him he can trust... I trust him. Hey, Ben, I need to tell you something. Surely, is it about my watch? I'm trying to do a good job. You're doing fine. I was, uh, on my way to prison before this. Whoa, ben, serious? are you serious? Are you, like, uh, taking this badly? You You're, like, the runt of the group. It's not it's your not place to... Oh. Just, if you hear anything, it's probably true. But now you know. Okay, now he took it the right way. I, uh, I... Ben, relax. Okay. Now anyway. Now, it's not going to let me tell Lily right now. She's going to have another, like, argument with me about something. But we'll save that for another day. I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? I wanted to follow up on what you said about stolen supplies. Do you know what's going on? I don't. I just heard you mention it. And you oh my gosh, shut up, Lily. I'm not stealing shit. I came in here to help. There's a traitor. Somebody, one of Are you sure about this? He or she or they have been taking things. Paranoia. Paranoia isn't gonna help us. I know what this sounds like, but I'm not paranoid. It counts off and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I see the count, and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I bet you differ. I don't I like you, Lily. I, I think you are stupid. So you want me to start one? I want you to poke around. What's there to go on? A broken flashlight. Quite the evidence. Tossed into the garbage. Huh. We don't toss out equipment. We fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you were using When do you should. when should you not be using a flashlight? There's no light here. There's only apocalypse. Okay, I'll poke around a little. You shouldn't have to question if someone uses a flashlight. If you don't find anything. I'm just going to assume. Oh, wonderful. Paranoia. A mystery. Jesus, doc. I'm sorry. Um, I heard you guys talking. You need to yeah, he's not. He's duck. He's not going to hear anything. Can I help? What did I just say? You're the greatest detective, and I oh can be Oh God, he wants to be Robin. Your ward. That's Robin. I know who it is. You know, I like Duck, so I'm going to indulge him. I'm going to indulge Duck. Plus, he made a cool Batman reference, and actually didn't say Robin. He said Dick Grayson. What do I do? I, I don't know. Go look around. Let me know if you find anything weird. As a Batman nerd, Dick Grayson's also Nightwing, but you know, whatever. 
<sighs> okay, there's my big thing of evidence. The flashlight. Huge evidence. Okay, Duck will help. Okay, well, this is a good time to wrap it up. Next time, I'm gonna just tell Lily about my criminal past, and I'm going to conduct her crazy search of paranoia. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.